So uh, we first started taking care of uh, Max around a year and a half back. Uh, he had been struggling with the diagnosis of acute uh, B lymphoblastic leukemia for uh, a couple of years by that time. He had received multiple rounds of different kinds of chemotherapies, uh, but he was not responding to any of those uh, drugs. We came to uh, Mass Hospital 1st October 2021. But when things we are not really going well. So around that time, his father came to us to see if there were any alternative treatment options that could be offered. Uh, there was there were some new drugs and new treatment protocols which we decided after discussing with the family to to try them. And subsequently, we took him for a half match haploidentical stem cell transplant. It was a very challenging situation because due to all the rounds of chemotherapy that he had received in the last two, three years, his immunity had become extremely weak. He had a very severe fungal uh, lung infection, but the transplant was his only shot that uh, could offer a chance of cure. It's now almost a year post transplant and it's like he's a completely different child. Uh, he has completed all of his treatment. He is in remission. There is no evidence of leukemia in his body right now. He is growing, playing like any healthy child of his age uh, with his siblings and his family. Uh, and it's a pleasure to see Max grow uh, and be like normal children after facing a very, very difficult three years struggling with a very difficult subtype of acute leukemia. At least she's a good and a caring, not just a doctor, a mother. She knows what it is to be a mother. She has done very perfectly well. Dr. Tisha, I thank her, she's the best. I thank Mass Hospital, I thank Dr. Tisha, I thank the whole team. God bless them. I'm happy, God bless them. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and press the bell icon to get the latest healthcare updates.